Hi, I'm Sam Kelly. I'm an artist and educator, and today I'm going to show you a printmaking activity to do with a cookie sheet. You'll need some tempera paints. I've got a couple different colors here. You'll need a cookie sheet or sort of a bread pan. I've chosen to use this um, smaller one to fit with the paper I have. You could do this on a huge cookie sheet or a casserole dish. You're going to need some paper towels and a popsicle stick or something to scratch into the paint with. And then you'll also need a piece of nice heavy white paper. So this is going to be a mono print, which I think is a really fun thing to show kids. It's something they may not have done before. I'm sure they've painted and they've drawn, but making a print is just a whole new thing. There's a level of uh, spontaneity to it that I think is really fun and being surprised by what comes out is a nice little treat. But I'm biased. I'm a printmaker myself. So here I'm just dabbing it on, taking care not to um, mix all the colors together into one big kind of flat plane of color and you don't want it to be too thick and as you can see there's some different textures going on so let's sort of heighten that let's wipe some spots away and get them to be a little bit more smooth and then these spots will leave sort of um, modeled and you could do this with all kinds of different materials anything you've got laying around cotton balls sponges um, leaves or plants and I'm just wiping the edges here so that we get a clean sort of print it's not going to be the cleanest print in the world I can tell you that right now but um, that will keep it a little bit more neat and so this is here really just to scratch into the paint you could also use your finger or um, the tip of a pencil and I'm just gonna make some abstract kind of squiggles So, now that you've got your sheet of paper, you're going to need to line it up. And this is a part where I would um, definitely help the child out because even myself, sometimes it's hard to get steady hands to place it just so. And if you haven't got a lot of paint on there, then you should just need to press gently. This paint is very watery so um, it, it smears quite easily. And then peel it off and all is revealed. A beautiful print using some things that you probably just have lying around the house. I'm Sam Kelly, thanks for joining me.